Hi everyone, you're watching Daisy After Dark. It's so nice to see you guys again. I know I haven't made a video in like forever. So, but anyway, today we're going to be making drunken melon balls. It's going to be fun. <laughs> but anyway, today what we'll be needing is can I need you and a seedless watermelon. It's actually pretty big, but you can find a small one. So, you need those three um, melons. And then you'll also need a measuring cup, pineapple juice, and triple sack, and vodka. Of course, you could use any liquor you want to, but um, this kind of stay with the triple sack because it's a sweetener. That will be, you know, better. It'll make your fruit really well sweet. But anyway, we have a um, melon scooper also. You can get this at like your HEB for like three bucks, maybe five. But let's see, we have that. And then, of course, a knife. You know, cut up your melon. And a cocktail glass for after the melon balls are ready and done. So, now we're gonna start. Down the boat. And cut it in half. And now we're gonna take out the seeds and stuff. Okay, so now I have my spoon. I'm gonna scoop this out really quick. And now you're gonna do this to all the um, well the um, cantaloupe and the honeydew. Pick out the seeds. You know, just like that. Now next is the honeydew. Wow, it's kind of a little bit harder to open. But we'll do the same thing with the honeydew. Well, we pretty much have the idea already, right? There it goes. You can see this like that. Now, I'm going to move these over to my tray because I need to get the big seedless watermelon. I'm gonna take the watermelon scooper or the melon scooper. want to start like from the outside through inside to be best. And this one is the cantaloupe. We're gonna do the cantaloupe, cantaloupe next. 
Same thing with the watermelon. Go ahead and make your melon ball. Make your melon ball. How about you? Sorry. There we go. Okay. Now, I'm gonna do the honeydew. And these are your finished melon balls. That's how they should look. Next, um, we're going to put pineapple juice. It's gonna be one cup with your measuring cup. Right there. So one cup of pineapple juice. Here we go. And then we're going to use one cup of purple sack. Nice sound. Sounds like me when I'm drinking a beer. Give it out to me. Anyway, here we go. One cup of purple sack. One cup of vodka. Now you can use any liquor, any flavored liquor that you want, like um, any flavored vodka, like raspberry, uh, strawberry, peach. Just for an example, you know. We don't have to use straight up vodka, non flavored, but it's your choice. One cup. This is your spoon because you want to kind of move them around a little bit so you can mix that a little bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you can get all the juices all even and stuff. Get them all almost. Nice and even. Covering them all. Okay. Here we go. See, just like that. Nice and even, just like that. Now we cover the egg. Now cover the container. Now we're gonna put this in the freezer for like an hour or two, and. Take it out and we'll see the finished product in a minute. Okay, so um, whenever you're done, put the lid on and you put it in the refrigerator for a couple hours. After that, you put it for partially in the freezer for a couple hours and a little bit, we'll see our finished product. And this is your finished product. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, 
so good. Yummy melon, drunken ball. Awesome.